Hi, my name is Jeremy Smith. I'm a physical therapist practicing in the Chicago area. Today we're going to talk about Body Track 2 Balance. The reason that it's changed my practice is it allows me to get objective data for my balance patients that then justifies continued treatment to the insurance companies and to the physician. It's a very, very cool product and I really want to show you all the capabilities about it today. So come check it out with me. So first things first, we have to get connected to the actual Body Track mat. In order to do that, we go to our Wi-Fi connection, you search for data port, which I've already connected to, and then we pull up the software. Initially, the software will look like this when you pull it up. In order to add a new patient for your evaluation, you're going to go to Patients and click Add. Now you're going to put in whatever the name of the patient is. For this purpose, we're going to do Test 1. You can put in their email, their ID, their weights, and anything you want in the comments. I personally like to put in their diagnosis so I have a better understanding of what I'm looking for. So let's call this one a right total knee. Save that and now all of the data that you collect is going to be saved to that patient's data. If you want to do an assessment, that's kind of your open book. You can do a multitude of things. You can have an auditory feedback that tells the individual when they are in and out of the zone by just clicking on this and creating that box. Now you can change that box to be whatever you want in order to allow that individual to stay in the box during a functional activity like a squat. If they go outside of that box, an auditory tone is created that indicates that they are outside of the box. Guided is where you're going to do your functional assessments. So you're going to have your modified cat sib, which then takes you through each condition. It walks you through it step by step, condition one, condition two, condition three, and condition four. So it's very, very user friendly. You collect all the data and then you finish and it saves into that patient's portal. If you want to continue to go down the line here, we have training, which becomes more of your athletic population where we can look at vertical forces during a functional movement like a squat. If you have an upper extremity injury, you can do a push-up and it tells you where all those vertical forces are going, whether it's right versus left, front versus back. All of that information will be inputted in. This blue screen here is actually the camera on your computer, so then you can line up the person's movement visually with what's going on in the pressure. The last thing over here is games. So we've created a bit of fun in the actual body track system. So for those patients that you want to continue to work on side to side movement, continue to work on improved weight shifting from side to side during gait, you can pull up something like this which is, a, is avoid the balls in order to continue playing the game. So as you shift right to left the paddle itself will actually move to try to avoid getting hit by the objects. Settings is here so you can change anything you need to within the system, including the sensor, whether you're using a Wi-Fi or a USB model. This is currently the Wi-Fi model, so it's set up through the Wi-Fi. Again, make sure that this is continually spinning in white. That indicates that you're connected to the mat. That's just a bit of an overview of the software. Now we're going to jump into a little bit more of patient treatment and how to use it with your patients.